keeping a little notepad by my desk. Um, <laughs> desk. Use the bedside table. But yeah, if I come up with other random, silly brain thoughts, I just write it on here and hope the heck that the pen works. Pencil would be better. But anyway, I found this book in the basement. It's surprisingly okay. Someone just abandoned it. And when I'm done with it, I will take it to the little street library. Which is what I usually do with my found books. It's about... <laughs> this book has everything. It's like... It's about a cruise ship that breaks down and a virus takes over it. So it's just like a norovirus, I guess. But, um... So there's start... Like, the place is broken down and the toilets don't work anymore and they have to poop in bags and and people are like making their own masks and stuff. I'm like, oh, this is very timely. Wow, thank you, can kind stranger who abandoned this virus-themed book. And then it also has ghosts. <laughs> so I'm like, this book has everything. It has a spooky ghosts, virus, and they're stuck on a cruise ship. Amazing. And there's a murderer. There's a murderer! First time an abandoned book has given me this much enjoyment. I wish I had this. In, this is like such a summer camping read. Oh my god. I know I keep teasing this sketchbook, but it's almost done. I'm literally like on the last signature. Okay, maybe, wait, is this a signature? It might be. They're small and they're falling out because like, it's really hard to draw when the spine is too, I have to put like a book under it. <laughs> Unscrupulous me probably would have like just let them fall out and be like, ha ha ha, the book is done. But I just, I like it so much <laughs> that I want to keep using it. Which is kind of unusual um, for me to just enjoy a sketchbook so much. Like it's so, like look how it, it just crinkles if you use water on it, um, which sucks. So it means I can't practice with watercolor in here. But like for sketching and stuff, it's pretty good. We're doing like words in our sketchbooks this month, the Patreon group. Yep. So I'm just excited. Like, look at all of this. I often don't publicize the Patreon sketchbooks because I feel like what's on there should stay there, but I'm thinking like that's just kind of silly, especially since like the entire point of the Patreon itself is kind of like it's meant to be like a group kind of thing. I wouldn't say it was a class because I'm not really like doing anything structured, but it's more like a, I guess it's kind of like a support group. It's like a sketchbook support group, I guess, if you could say that. Oh yeah, someone recently asked how my bicycle was doing um, because I, oh, for instance, that painting video, um, it's dirty. We keep our bikes indoors. Uh, theft is just so bad out here. Um, apart from all the dirt, like, it's really, it's better than I th thought it would be, although I don't know what I thought since, again, it doesn't hang out in the rain. There's definitely, like, one part around here that, like, got chipped off because the chain, uh, fell on it. <laughs> uh, so any metal will definitely scrape off the paint. I've had my lock on here a few times, so, like, just, like, tiny little cosmetic differences. It's so dirty. Um, the handlebars are a disaster though because of this basket. Um, it doesn't fit so it just, when I'm cycling it rattles like this and it's not only just taking my paint off, it's going right down to the the metal so any factory paint that was on here is gone too. So I don't know if I can like really say that that was a fail but because it was gonna happen whether I painted it or not I honestly figured that this would come off pretty fast again I don't know why because I don't 
I can't cycle in the rain or anything because I like personalizing things and I figured you know if I had to paint it every few years then that's great because then I can personalize it in a new way as my tastes change but I have obviously have not had to or been able to I can see where my bike lump block used to sit I thought this was a radish but it's awfully big <laughs> what the why is he so big what is this <laughs> 